Why probate a will? Hi, I'm attorney Paul DeLauri, and that's a question that I get quite often. Usually this is how it comes up. So someone calls me and says that their loved one died and uh, they're trying to uh, handle the bank account, the deceased person's bank accounts and transfer them. And uh, the bank's legal department says that they need to do a probate. And maybe they've tried to sell the house and it's under contract and there's a closing date and the title company comes back and says, whoa, 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 you need to get appointed as personal representative first. And then the, you know, the person named in the will is calling me and saying, well, what's up? I mean, I'm named in the will. What, what do you mean probate? What are you talking about? Well, so here's how it actually works. When you're named in the will to be appointed as personal representative, that means you're nominated. That means you have priority to be appointed as personal representative. That doesn't automatically make you the personal representative. So you have to, if you need to do a pro, if you need to become personal representative to administer your loved one's estate, then the will has to be probated with the court and you need to be appointed as personal representative. Just because you're named in the document by itself doesn't do anything. Um, but hold on here. But before you go racing off to the court to do that, make sure you actually have to do it because title companies sometimes are wrong and banks are sometimes wrong. So it's really good to talk to a probate attorney. Um, we can help you. You can certainly just give us a call. Uh, and if you need a probate, we'll tell you. If you don't need one, we'll tell you. But there, there might be an exception to it. And title companies and banks are nowadays kind of notorious for just automatically requiring a probate or saying that they need to have a probate uh, when actually it may not be necessary. So it's really good, regardless of the situation, it's really good to just get some help, get a second set of eyes of a probate attorney looking at it and telling you one way or the other um, what you need to do. So uh, why probate a will? Um, you, if it turns out that someone needs to be appointed as personal representative, then the reason to probate the will is to have the court approve the will and appoint you to become, or appoint the person named in the will to become the personal representative. And then that person, the new personal representative, has the full authority to manage assets and sell the house and do all that kind of thing. So if you have any other questions about this or anything, give us a call. Um, our contact information's in the, uh, in the notes. And be sure to like and subscribe to this video, okay? Thanks a lot. Have a great day.